Hi, welcome to Lessons with John. Today we're going to try Toxic by The Boy With Hook. All right, I just learned this five minutes ago, so forgive me. <laughs> yeah. That's your verse one. Okay? So what he's doing there is he's finger picking, first of all. So we're holding down this chord. Uh, you know, it's a, what a, a G sharp minor, I guess. So, or A flat minor. Um, first string, second fret. Third string, third fret. Second string, fourth fret. Okay? Looks like a G minor that you moved up to the second fret. You can think of it that way. So, what I'm doing with my right hand is I'm going, so three, two, one, just like that. That's my rhythm. My next chord, I'm holding down the third string first fret, the first string first fret, the second string second fret, and then I'm just going to do the same thing. Three, two, one. Then I'm going to go to like an E shape. So uh, first string second fret, fourth string and second string fourth fret. So third string and second string fourth fret, first string second fret. Do the same str uh, pick picking pattern, just like that. Three, two, one. Now the next part's a little different. I'm going to hold down the third string, third fret, the second string, second fret, with my two fingers like that, and then I'll have this guy available to add when I need it. So I'm going to right here. I'm going to go third string, second string, third string, add the second string, third fret, just like that. So, so you got. Oh, sorry. It's this is a little different. It's like that's it. thinking later on the song changes at the rhythm so all right so that's your verse one that never comes back again exactly that way he does it in a different way later on all right now your chorus uh, comes in next you need an E chord for that to a B to an E flat I stopped yelling out chords because I was about to screw up. <laughs> so you got an E chord for down, 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 up. Something like that would do, kind of fits. So down, 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 up. Um, the E chord is the first string, second fret, the four, three, and two at the fourth fret, and I'm gonna go down, 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 up. Then I need a B chord, so I'm gonna cover the top two strings at the second fret, third string, third fret, fourth string, fourth fret, same strum, down, 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 up. So you got E to B. Now he goes to an E flat chord. First string, first fret, third string, and second string, third fret. Open fourth string. Same strum. Okay, down, 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 up. Now here's where I stopped yelling out chords because I was going to screw up. <laughs> A flat minor. <coughs> Excuse me. First string, second fret. Uh, third string, third fret. 4th string, 4th fret, and then I'm going to stick my pinky on the 2nd string, 4th fret. That one I'm going to do a short down, down, up, just like that. Then I'm going to use this as my guide finger. I'm going to drag it back, and I need a G flat chord. So I'm going to bar the top 3 strings at the 1st fret, 2nd string, 2nd fret, and then my guide finger went to the 4th string, 3rd fret and the same quick strum, down, down, up. So it sounds like this. E to the B to the E flat, A flat minor, G flat, okay? And you do that three times in a row. And fast, it sounds like this. I'll just do it once. Okay? And then you do that three times in a row, and then the fourth time you play the E chord again, to the B chord again, but now you stay on the E flat. So down, 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 up, up, down, 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 up. And that's your chorus, and that comes back just like that every single time. The last time that they play it, he ends on a um, an E chord uh, for the end of the song. Okay, so in case I forget to tell you that. So that was your chorus. 
Okay, so now with Toxic, this is sort of like a bridge. I think of it as a bridge, but he also uses the same thing for the next two verses when they come up, okay? So what he's got here is um, he's got that first chord that he played like in the intro. And he pauses. Sorry, pause again and then. And then. And, and then that repeats twice. So let me go over. It's, it's that G, uh, A flat minor, I guess you'd call it. Uh, first string, second fret, third string, third fret, fourth string, uh, second string, fourth fret, sorry. And then all he does is he hits the top three strings. So three, two, and one. Uh, I'm going to use these three fingers to pick it. Then I hit the thumb on the third string, and then the first two fingers hit the first two strings like that. So it's like all together thumb and then the one and two fingers so you should be able to figure it out from that then there's two beats of paw you know rest you could call it then we're going to go to this chord the uh, g flat chord that uh, so third string first fret first string first fret and then second string second fret do the same thing and then the e chord so the first string second fret the fourth string um, and no, sorry, the third string and the second string, fourth fret, do the same thing. Then I'm going to go to a new chord. I'm going to bar the top, well, it's actually not a new chord, it's the B chord, basically. You bar the top two strings and then the third string, third fret, you, could, you just need that. And you do that, um, like that. But then he goes right without that rest that he's had in between every other chord. He, uh, he goes... That last one was the E flat, so I got top two strings, second fret, third string, third fret. Then I pivot around and I have the first string, first fret, second string, and third string, third fret, except they're like this, with no pause and nobody talking in between. So let me play that part a couple times for you here. calling that a bridge. Um, I, I can't remember what the lyrics are, but it doesn't sound exactly like the verse. But then, so he does that twice, and then the verse comes in. This is, um, uh, you know, it sounds more like a verse. He's doing that again two more times. So technically, you just do that four times in a row, if you want to think of it that way. Then you have the chorus comes back, which we've already talked about. That comes back just the way it, does, uh, it did before. Then another verse, the only difference with this verse is he plays that, this again, with the pauses in between, and then, and he does it twice, sorry. here there's a measure of rest so four beats of nothing going on with the ook at all I can't remember what's going on in the song but it's it has to be accounted for so and then the chorus starts again and you could think of it like doing a chorus just the way we did it before and then they do it again so two choruses in a row and then he just ends on an E chord and that's it so it's like intro no sorry no intro the verse one which never comes back again the way you play it, and then the chorus, then the bridge, and the verse two, which are exactly the same, and then chorus again, and then another verse, but with an extra measure of rest in it at the end, and then two choruses in a row, and you end on an E chord. And what I'm looking at over there is my sheet, it's all written out, so there'll be a link hopefully to that. Emma will put it out there, and you can take a look at it, and it'll all make sense. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe and play more Ook.